guys. Welcome back to my channel. But I've never been to Nona's. So I want to go to Nona's. Is that pizza? Yeah. No. You got to let it go. Hey guys, what's up? Danielle here and welcome back to my channel. So if you are new here, hi, welcome. If you are returning, thank you so much for coming back. Welcome to today's video. Make sure you all are subscribed, so go click that button and join the family. Make sure you guys follow me on my Instagram as well, which will be right here, as well as all my other social medias and my Instagram will be linked down in the description. Below. So for today's video, I wanted to share my go-to everyday summer makeup tutorial um, just because it's super basic, super easy, and all the products I use, I am in love with. So without further ado, let's get glam and let's just dive right into this video. So first things first, I always use this headband or like just something to pull my hair back. This is from Forever 21. It was in my summer haul video, which will be linked down in the description below. Also, another thing that I use um, every day in the morning is the Clinique Moisture Surge. I use this moisturizer every morning just to give my face a good... Another thing I use every day is the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Velour Lip Scrub in the Flavor Mojito. I got this on Black Friday, which I will have that video linked down in the description below as well. I love this so much because it helps my lips be a lot smoother, gets all the dead skin off. And what I love so much about this product is that it's edible. In my summer haul, I showed you guys the Milk Makeup Cooling Water. And I use this every day before I put on my makeup. It just helps so much. I tend to get really sunburn right here. I get bags really easily because no sleep summer. So now that we have the cooling water on, I let it sit for a little bit and then I have straight into my routine. So the primer that I use is the Tarte Base Tape. It smells so good. So now that we primed, it's on to foundation. I got the new Tarte Found Sealer, and this is in the shade 13N, which is fair neutral. And this is my literal holy grail. It's the first foundation that I genuinely, genuinely love. Pump a few things on the back of my hand. And I just use my Morphe sponge and another sponge. We're on to concealer. I use the Tarte Shape Tape. This is in the shade Light. It just does wonders for my under eyes. A little goes a long way. I wipe off a lot of the excess product and I just do a little dab, dab, dab. And then I put a little bit on my chin, my cupid's bow, my nose, and my forehead. Blend it all in. Is yeah, this coffee? Fix it. Yeah. Oh, I thought it was like put your makeup sponge in or something. <laughs> yep, this is my makeup sponge. I feel like I don't even drink coffee, I just eat creamer and sugar. You eat creamer? Yeah. If I fall back, I'm killing you. <laughs> so we are all blended out. So next, we set our face using, of course, the go-to Laura Mercier Translucent Loose Setting Powder. Apply it to my under eyes. <laughs> We 
we just let it sit a little bit. Okay, so now that my bake is done, I just take this brush and I just kind of wipe off the excess. We're moving on to bronzer. I like the nice bronzy type look. So I always use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Powder Bronzer and this is the shade Rosewood. Just take a little bit, just a little bit, and just kind of do circular motions. blush and I use the Tarte Amazonian clay 12 hour blush in the shade party smile put it on the dimples put on the cheekbones Check. I'm gonna do my brows so I just use the Anastasia Beverly Hills brow Wiz in the shade taupe so I take the spoolie and I just brush out my brows I don't like to do a lot to them I think they're pretty good the way they are, just like to maybe touch them up a little bit, so. But just where I see like sparse spots of hair. Let's move on to highlight. I use the Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector Pressed in the shade Champagne Pop. I love the bronzy glowy look, so I kind of add a lot of highlight. Um, not too overpowering, but... Now on to the eyes. So this eye look is so, so, so basic. We're just using a product we literally already used, so you can do it all at once, but I like going in like the order. So, we're going back with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Bronzer. Tap it in there a little bit. Get off the excess and just go over the eyes. Time for mascara. So first things first, I always curl my lashes. If I know I'm swimming that day, which I'm not today, so I'm not going to do it because it's harder to get off. Um, if I know I'm going to be around water, whatever. Um, I always use the Too Faced Better Than Sex waterproof mascara, but um, on normal days when I'm just out and about, not by any water, I use the Benefit Roller Lashes Mascara. It's so good for my lashes. I literally noticed a difference after using them, so I just apply a little coat. <laughs> On to lips. I use the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Lip Quench in the shade Pink Sand. I just picked this up from Sephora. I'll have that, that video linked down in the description below. <sighs> Smells so good. It's so perfect for summer. It adds just a little bit of color to my lips while quenching their thirst. So, just apply it, and voila. So now that everything is done, we need to set our face. It's summer, you get hot, you get sweaty. MAC Fix Plus. Where is it? And voila. So I'm filming on my phone now because my memory card decided to stop working and it's like you ran out of space while well, I deleted everything off you. So hopefully I get one, a new memory card soon. But anyways, I just want to thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed my go-to summer makeup tutorial. 
I literally love it. It brings me from maybe like a five to like eight or nine. I don't know. Um, but it just makes me feel so confident, so good. So be sure to give this video a big thumbs up, leave a comment down below, and click subscribe. Also, follow me on my Instagram, which will be right here. And you can find everything down in the description below. Check out some of my other videos that I'll have linked down in the description for you guys. And I love you all so much. I will see you guys all next Friday. Bye, guys.